So really it all started four years ago. <laughs> Four years ago, Zach Falbo told me that you existed when I was in Pennsylvania. <laughs> Four months later, I flew out to meet you. So I flew out and I met her, I actually surprised her, and she just screamed as soon as she opened the door to the house where I was. She just screamed, she couldn't believe I was there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, thankful, uh, I'm thankful for that trip, it was like the best four days of my life, so. Mm -hmm. How's life? Life is good, it's good. the best weekend of my life. Literally crazy. <laughs> God, it's super overwhelming. I don't know what to say. After that, we just kept getting to know each other. We went to the Philippines for a two week trip, and that's kind of where we spent like a lot of time together. Enjoyed working together and serving the Lord together um, at kids' camps and different children's homes and prisons. So um, that was a really special time. We made it out alive. Uh, we just uh, saw some tigers. It was insane. Um, it was amazing. We are pumped. We're excited to see what's next. And then that fall, I had one year left at PCC, so Mark moved down and he worked at a church interned nearby and we got to spend a lot of time together and that really helped get to know each other since we had never really spent a consistent amount of time together in person. Hey guys, coming to you live from PCC Beach. <laughs> Anyways, we just want to say hello from 2015 and uh, we love you guys. And uh, that's the view right now. It's pretty awesome. And after that, we were moved to Canoga Park. Mm -hmm. And for the last two years, we've been here in Canoga Park, and it's been amazing. Just really had a chance to just go through some ups, ups and downs, actually spent some time apart. But God's brought us back together, and really that brings us to the engagement. We were in Hawaii, I was shooting a wedding, she was able to come. Mm -hmm. And uh, at the very last day of the trip, we went to the Nepali coast in Kauai. The whole trip I hoped that he had he was going to propose and he hadn't proposed. Um, so the last day I just kind of let it go, enjoyed swimming around with the dolphins and turtles and uh, just enjoying the day on the coast and then we swam out to a rock. A couple. Well, she almost forth. didn't swim out to the rock. She was That's nervous because it was all dangerous and sharp and That's big true. waves. So I just jumped scary. in with the ring in my pocket and then she fo she followed. So I'm very yeah. grateful that you followed. So she <laughs> Actually, I think someone out. on the boat pushed me in. Yeah, they pushed her in. And but. then she got up there and then we were facing to the camera for the picture and then as she was facing the camera, I got on my knee and proposed and all she did was scream. She didn't even say yes. She just yeah, it was screamed. so exciting. And in the boat later, she said yes. Yes, and we had a great time scuba or snorkeling Definitely. off the Nepali coast. That was great. Mm -hmm. And then the last two months have been a whirlwind of just planning and being excited and telling all our friends and family and mm -hmm. just getting really um, getting pumped for the wedding. So yeah. looking it's been forward a, to it. A long journey, four, four years basically since four we first years. started talking. Honestly, maybe to the day. I don't know when we first started talking in July four years ago, but it's like July 23rd wow. right now. Yeah, four years. So it's kind of crazy. Sure but yeah. um, I'm just super thankful for how the Lord has brought us together. I remember when we first started talking, Mark mentioned that he really felt burdened to be part of a church plant. And um, in the coming months, right after we get married, we'll be moving to Arizona and helping um, some wonderful friends start a church in Phoenix, Arizona. Yes, please pray for us. We'll, we'll be out there in just a few months and we're gonna be moving two times right after we get married and we'll end up in Tempe, Arizona, right out of sight of Phoenix at the end of this year. So please pray that God blesses that work and just guides us. And we're just so excited to see what the Lord has for us. And it is just kind of a journey of faith. The next really eight months are just gonna be a whirlwind, but we couldn't be more excited. And thank you so much just for your support, for your love for us, for being parts of our lives. And we love you guys and uh, looking forward to seeing you at the wedding or sooner in, in the future. <laughs> we love you guys.